Welcome to the clubhouse. I'm Billy Jackson. This is my cat tack. And today we're going to be reviewing The Walking Dead Season 8 Episode 12. Alright guys, I have to admit, I actually like this episode. Um, I know The Walking Dead has gotten bad over the past couple of seasons. I, I'm, one, I'm with you. I think that the past couple of seasons have really sucked, except for a few key episodes. Um, and the beginning of this season, I thought was okay, um, but you can see my reviews, you know, the first episode I thought was awesome, and um, episode nine I thought was good. This episode I really liked. Um, the only thing I didn't like about it was, you know, Negan getting away from Rick again. You know, I wish they would just solve that problem, you know, they would at least you know fight more you know have more dialogue but that being said what they did give me with Rick and Negan I did like um, I, I loved every second of it you know so but I just wanted more I want more of them and their dynamic and their chemistry that they have I, I need it I want it and when they were giving it to me I was like yes Walking Dead is back you know and that's how I felt this whole episode this actually felt like you know uh, Walking Dead episode. You know, this is what we need. The, you know, stakes are high. You know, the the um, bad the the main villain and the main hero are fighting and talking. You know, and uh, talking, not really talking. Well, when they're talking to each other. Oh, and Rick, when Rick gets the bat, I uh, I was like, yeah. And he was like, maybe I'll make you kiss, give it a give, goodbye kiss. I was just like, I think I would say that in that moment. I mean, I, I love the whole interaction between Rick and Negan this episode. But if I get that every episode, I will say that I love that episode. But um, Because some of this episode did feel a little rushed, I think. Um, I don't know if rushed is the right word. But the whole, um, I can't remember the guy's name with the handlebar mustache um, that talks way too much. Um I, I don't understand his motivations. You know, first he's with Negan, that now he's not. This is the first time, unless I'm wrong, correct me in the comments below if I'm wrong on this, but is this not the first time that we see him, like, betraying Negan? Um, and then when he gets the group together and gets them all pumped up for Negan, he's for Negan? I don't know. I, maybe I missed something, but I, I thought that was way underdeveloped. You know, um, I did not see that coming, um, and I, I didn't like it. But that being said, they're on their way. You know, I did like that he changed. You know, from we're not going to hurt them to let's kill them all. You know, and then that made um, uh, what's his name? I can't remember his name. Um, you know, the guy with the burnt face. You know, he's going, oh man, oh gosh, what I get myself into. So. You know, the stakes are high. It's getting ready to go down, you know, and I'm excited for it. And then Trash Lady has Negan. Now, I'm on the fence with this. At first, I was like, oh, he's getting ready to die. Then uh, she hits him over the head, you know, and I was like, oh, this is going to straggle on. This is how she's going to die at the hands of Negan. So we hate Negan more. And I'm calling it right now. He's going to kill her. And then who knows what's going to happen after that because she's the last of the trash people. Uh, but that being said, I did like the whole episode overall. I feel like you know, I'm pumped up. I, I was even with my buddy Ricky. Shout out to you, Ricky. Um, Saturday night and we were you know talking about The Walking Dead and everything. And, you know, that's one of our shows. And, you know, I, I was even telling him, I'm not really excited about watching it. I'm kind of watching it just because I'm invested with the characters and the storyline. And I just want to see how it ends. And I've seen every single episode. I'm not going to miss an episode. I'm just that invested. Um, but I just wasn't excited. After watching this episode, I'm excited for next week's episode. So... That being said, I felt like this was an actual Walking Dead episode, and I liked it. Um, so that's my opinion. But guys, it's not all about me. It's about you. So what do you think about the episode? Let me know in the comments below. Um, and as always, make yourself happy every day. Oh, remember to like and subscribe to my channel. And as always, make yourself happy every single day. And the only way to do that is to remember, the only thing stopping you is you stopping. Bam!